The Bureau of Labor Statistics BLS is a unit of the United States Department of Labor. It is the principal fact-finding agency for the U.S. government in the broad field of labor economics and statistics and serves as a principal agency of the U.S. federal statistical system. The BLS is a governmental statistical agency that collects, processes, analyzes, and disseminates essential statistical data to the American public, the U.S. Congress, other federal agencies, state and local governments, business, and labor representatives. The BLS also serves as a statistical resource to the United States Department of Labor, and conducts research into how much families need to earn to be able to enjoy a decent standard of living. The BLS data must satisfy a number of criteria, including relevance to current social and economic issues, timeliness in reflecting today's rapidly changing economic conditions, accuracy and consistently high statistical quality, impartiality in both subject matter and presentation, and accessibility to all. To avoid the appearance of partiality, the dates of major data releases are scheduled more than a year in advance, in coordination with the Office of Management and Budget. History The Bureau of Labor was established in the Department of the Interior by the Bureau of Labor Act 23 Stat. 60, June 27, 1884, to collect information about employment and labor. It followed the hearings led by Henry W. Blair of the Committee of the Senate upon the relations between labor and capital. Carol D. Wright was the first U.S. Commissioner of Labor. It became an independent sub-cabinet department by the Department of Labor Act 25 Stat. 182, June 13, 1888. It was incorporated, as the Bureau of Labor, into the Department of Commerce and Labor by the Department of Commerce Act 32 Stat. 827, February 14, 1903. Finally, it was transferred to the Department of Labor in 1913 where it resides today. The BLS is now headquartered in the Postal Square building near the United States Capitol and Union Station. Since 1915, the BLS has published a journal, The Monthly Labor Review, with articles about the data and methodologies of labor statistics. The BLS is headed by a commissioner who serves a four-year term from the date he or she takes office. The most recent commissioner of labor statistics was Erica Groshen, who was confirmed by the U.S. Senate on January 2, 2013 and sworn in as the 14th commissioner of labor statistics on January 29, 2013, for a term that ended on January 27, 2017. William Wyatrovsky, Deputy Commissioner of the BLS, is serving as Acting Commissioner until the next Commissioner is sworn in. William Beach has been nominated for the position. Statistical reporting Statistics published by the BLS fall into four main categories. Topic. Prices U.S. Consumer Price Index Producer Price Index U.S. Import and Export Price Indices Consumer Expenditure Survey topic. Employment and unemployment Current Population Survey the Household Survey The American Time Use Survey Current Employment Statistics the Establishment Survey Payroll Employment Economic Geography Salary Data Local Area Unemployment Statistics LAUS List of US States by Unemployment Rate 
Current Employment Statistics State and Area Program The Job Openings and Labor Turnover Survey JOLTS. The Quarterly Census of Employment and Wages QCEW. The Business Employment Dynamics BED Program 10-Year Occupational Employment Projections Occupational Employment Statistics OES. Mass layoff statistics discontinued in 2013. Topic: <laughs> Compensation and working conditions. National Compensation Survey. Employment Cost Index. Workplace injury and fatality statistics. Topic. Productivity Labor productivity, aggregate and by industry Multifactor productivity Topic. Statistical regions Data produced by the BLS is often categorized into groups of states known as census regions. There are four census regions, which are further categorized by census division as follows Northeast Region New England Division, Connecticut, Maine, Massachusetts, New Hampshire, Rhode Island, and Vermont Middle Atlantic Division, New Jersey, New York, and Pennsylvania, South Region South Atlantic Division, Delaware, District of Columbia, Florida, Georgia, Maryland, North Carolina, South Carolina, Virginia, and West Virginia. East-South Central Division, Alabama, Kentucky, Mississippi, and Tennessee. West-South Central Division, Arkansas, Louisiana, Oklahoma, and Texas, Midwest Region, East-North Central Division, Illinois, Indiana, Michigan, Ohio, and Wisconsin. West-North Central Division, Iowa, Kansas, Minnesota, Missouri, Nebraska, North Dakota, and South Dakota, West Region. Mountain Division, Arizona, Colorado, Idaho, Montana, Nevada, New Mexico, Utah, and Wyoming. Pacific Division, Alaska, California, Hawaii, Oregon, and Washington. Topic. See also Alternative Employment Arrangements Bureau of Economic Analysis Career Guide to Industries Data.gov Economic Reports Index of Leading Indicators Job Creation Index Monthly Labor Review National Income and Product Accounts Occupational Outlook Handbook U.S. Census Bureau USA Facts Topic. Footnotes Topic. Further reading Joseph P. Goldberg and William T. Moy, The First 100 Years of the Bureau of Labor Statistics. Bulletin No. 2235. Washington, D.C., U.S. Government Printing Office, 1985. William J. Wyatrovsky. BLS at 125, Using Historic Principles to Track the 21st Century Economy. Monthly Labor Review, June 2009, pp. 3-25. Topic. External links Official website Records of the Bureau of Labor Statistics in the National Archives Record Group 257 
Bureau of Labor Statistics in the Federal Register Publications of the BLS available on Fraser Bulletins of the United States Bureau of Labor Statistics, dating back to 1895 Local Area Unemployment Reports <laughs>